<laughs> Hello, Computer Studies 10. Uh, some of you have been having some troubles with working with your code that you've downloaded from GitHub. And there's a bunch of different people experiencing different problems, but I think it all kind of stems from the same issue. So if you've been having problems opening up your code, say for example, you can't view your website in a browser, or you can't see your CSS file, you can only open one file at a time, all these problems, I think, stem down to the fact that when you download your repository, you know, your code from GitHub, it comes in a zip file. So you have to extract that zip file. So here's the story. So when you're in your repository of where your code is, uh, you know, you can see your folder and everything, you're going to download that folder um, as a zip file. So I'm going to go, uh, oops, code, and then download zip. So it'll bring me over here. I'll just put it to my desktop for now and save it. Okay, so if I go to my desktop, here it is. Here's my, it looks a little funny. Maybe yours looks a little different. It has a different icon. Mine, I don't have a weird tiny icon. <laughs> I'm not too sure that is. So it's like, hey, what do I do with this? This is not actually a folder. Even if you open it up, you'll notice that it looks like we're in a folder. Uh, and yours might look different than this. Uh, especially if you're on a Mac, but you know, if you open this up and you, it looks like you're sort of in this folder type of situation and you might try to interact with your files, but you can't actually do that. You have to extract all this stuff. This is actually a single file. All the zeros and ones have been squished together so you can download it as one single file. You can't actually download a folder. It has to be turned into a file. So we need to pull all that apart. And the easiest way to do that is just pull the folder out of this window. So I can just click and drag first web page, say onto my desktop, or it could be into another folder if you prefer. And then, you know, I already have that here, so I'm just gonna, you know, whatever, let's replace it. And there it is. So now it's a folder. So that first thing you download, don't work directly inside of that. Extract the files by dragging and dropping to another place. You can also press the extract button if you're opening. If, I don't know if you have this program in particular. It doesn't really matter. It just showed up in Windows File Explorer. That's good. But now I can open this up, and now I can access these things. Now I can double click on this and see what's happening inside of here. Uh, I can also right click and opad, no, open in Notepad++ plus plus, uh, with no troubles, because now it's in a folder as opposed to a zip file. So there you go, I'll just open these things up. It'll take a second. <laughs> Should be able to get these things to work. Um, open this, and that's great. Hey, there we go. So now I can sort of start working on my project. When you are you know, done or you just wanna back up the progress you've made, you know, save all your files, and then you'll wanna upload this back to GitHub. So just do those steps we learned in the past, where you go to your repository, and now I want to like upload this again because maybe I've made some changes. So I'll click Add File, Upload Files, and it'll give you that drag and drop space here. So I can just click and drag that folder. I don't think anything will change because I didn't make any changes. You know, it's like trying to update these things. You know, commit changes. <laughs> I, apparently, I lost my internet connection in the middle of this. So, wow. Yay, internet. There we go. <laughs> uh, oh, it says, uh, oh, it says, I, it, I guess I'll do it again. It doesn't really matter. Like, this is just the, the, the stages you do it. And I can press commit changes. And it'll process my files. And then it'll be ready. It'll all be backed up and ready to hand in. So that's probably what people are, where things are going wrong, is you're working directly inside of the zip file that you downloaded instead of, um, extracting that by clicking on the folder and dragging it out to a different place. So try that and let me know if it doesn't if it doesn't work. Um, and you're also welcome to come in on Wednesday during flex time uh, or Thursday during flex time. It won't be due till Wednesday, but you know so, if things still go poorly uh, for you, I'm not going to be taking off late marks. This is you know all part of the fun of working remotely and trying to figure things out. So that's the story. Hopefully that made sense and try it out. And if it doesn't, then come in on Wednesday and we'll work on it together. Bring your laptop. We'll figure it out. Okay. Hey, thanks. Uh, CS10. We'll see you soon.